Yes. A 40 year old Trump supporter, Matt Coleman, was arrested in Tijuana recently where he went with his two year old son and 10 month old daughter to murder them with a spear because he was convinced that his wife was a lizard person who passed alien lizard DNA onto his children. Now, that was a very heavy sentence. Would you... Is that... Did I lose you? You're breaking Even up a bit. Even when I use a hotspot, sucks. Even when I, when I use the Wi-Fi, it sucks. When I use the hotspot, it sucks. Just the, the internet completely sucks. We're not really streaming right now. No one can see or hear me. It's the same as last week, and it sucks. It just sucks. And I don't know what to do. It's my computer. It's, it just doesn't want to stream. No one can hear me at all, and I think I've lost money. And I'm on a hot spot. No, I can just still hear you. Sucks. I can still okay. hear you just coming in kind of on the bad side. You, you, you look like okay. a spaceman. Just... Oh, oh, well, that's awesome. At least I've got that going. Uh, did you hear my intro to this bit? I, I heard the setup. I didn't hit the, hear the punchline. Okay. I'm going to go through that again. Okay. Uh, a 40-year-old Trump-supporting QAnon believer named Matthew Coleman was arrested in Tijuana recently, where he went with his two-year-old son and ten-month-old daughter to murder them with a spear because he believed that his was a lizard person who passed alien lizard DNA onto his children. That is a very heavy sentence, Bunny. he would end up that for you. Very heavy sentence? What, what's it do for me? No, would you like to... My internet... Oh, I don't know what you're going to do. You want to I don't know. I don't know. The internet just sucks. Yeah. Uh, I mean, I don't know. Yeah. I, I might be down with that. I might be down with that. I don't know, because this internet, as it is right now, just sucks. Uh, would you like me to repeat ears? any of that? Yeah, we need. I need to get up on the roof and just move the antenna around. Because that's the, the technology I'm using out here. Uh, that sentence was a heavy one, Bunny. Would you like me to repeat that for you? Oh, yes, please. Okay. So, a Trump-supporting QAnon believer named Matthew Coleman got his two very young kids, took them to Tijuana, and stabbed them to death with a spear because he was convinced that his wife was a secret alien lizard person who had given his children alien lizard DNA and that his children would grow up to be monsters so he killed them to save the planet. Yes. So, uh, first off, wow, thank you for saving us, Matthew. I would have hated for your children to grow up to become hideous monsters and kill us all. So really, the guy's a hero. Yeah. Uh, Matthew Taylor Coleman, because murderers have three names. They always Matthew do. Taylor Coleman owned... They always do. They always do. Matthew Taylor Coleman owned a surfing school in Santa Barbara and told police that by killing his kids, he was saving the world from monsters. He killed his own children, and then here's, here's what I think is the punchline. He then tried to illegally cross the border, and I'm so sick and tired of white people coming over here illegally and taking all of our jobs. Yes. We need to build a wall to keep the white people out. That's what I think. Uh, uh, anywho... I'm glad this story made the news because a lot of parents nowadays are very worried. They've been coming up to me and they've been saying, Steve, you gotta help me. Are my children lizard people? Have my kids been in 
infected by my partner with alien DNA? And what country is best for stabbing my alien monster children with spears? Well, fear not, America, because the Pope on Film podcast is here. I have come up with some questions that you, the listener, you, the viewer, can ask your children to ascertain whether your kids are secretly alien lizard people. Yes. So uh, I've just, just, just some really easy, simple questions. And you ask these questions, and that is how you figure out whether your kids are alien lizard people. Uh, and we will try it now. Uh, hey, Maxwell. Can you come here for a sec? Okay, just come here. Come here. Uh, come here. Come here. Come here. Hi, Maxwell. Hi. Uh, you doing good? Yeah. Good, good, good. How old are you again? 14? No, I'm I'm nine. You're nine. One month uh, after this month, I'm going to be 10. Ah, the big 1-0. Oh. Mm -hmm. uh, that's a Double big one. Digits. Double digits. Very proud of you. Yes. You're so old. You're getting so old, Maxwell. Okay. So I've, so I've got some, some questions. I got, so what are you doing? Um, right now. About to eat lunch? Yeah. Cool. You know what I want to do? What? Lay on a hot, flat rock, totally naked, and just bask in the heat. Does that sound good to you, Maxwell? No, I would turn into a chicken nugget. Oh, a okay. human sized okay. chicken nugget. So you're about to eat. Yes. So, 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 I have a question for you. What would you like to eat? Chicken nuggets, <coughs> or, hear me out, Crickets. Nope. I no think crickets. both of them sound good. Which one would you like? Chicken nuggets or crickets? Chicken oh man, they, are you sure? The no. crickets sound yummy. No. How about flies? No. No. I, I no small defense. Video bugs. evidence of Maxwell no. eating crickets before. And it is a good point. I do have video of you eating a cricket. Yeah, but we're I hated it. Too? I was eating it too. Okay, you got me there. Okay. Ah, um, oh, hold on a second. I'm just scratch. My scales really itch right now. It, do you ever have that problem, Maxwell? Do your scales ever itch? No, you don't have scales. I don't have scales. No one in this house mm. has scales. Hmm. Okay. Okay. Hey, Maxwell, I love you. I love you very much. Once you know that, son, I love you. You know what else I love? Uh, secretly belonging to the class Reptilia. I mean, <coughs> Soros and Hillary. <coughs> high five! <coughs> no high five? No high five for our leader, George Soros? And Hugo Chavez, which is trying to institute uh, a, a global, global rule? Who are those people? The New World Order? Who are those people? Scott Hall, Kevin Nash, nothing? No. Hillary Clinton, high five. No. Mm. Eating babies. No. No. <coughs> okay, good. You passed the test. Come here. You passed the test. You passed the test. You're not an alien lizard person. Give me a hug. Bring it in. There you go. Okay, you're not a lizard person. You can go eat lunch now. And see, it's that easy, parents. Just some, just some very simple questions. You ask that to your kids, and that way you ascertain whether they have been infected with the evil alien DNA. If they have, just get yourself some spears, apparently. I, I, I think we, we get the spear gun anyway, just to be on the safe side. Just to be on the safe side, <coughs> yes. He you can never little, be... He, he seemed a little evasive on some of those questions. He seemed very upset with some of the questions. Almost too upset. Uh -huh. Like, maybe he was upset that I was questioning his loyalty to the evil alien overlords, but you know what? We, I'm glad I that... You're not a lizard! Okay. Okay. Of course, that's what a lizard would say, but... Yeah. I'm not a lizard! It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Even if you were, I would love my alien son. When I said that, I, I was going for a Heather's reference, and I don't know if anybody got that, but... I yeah. love my alien son. You know? Bella gets it, so that's good. Okay, so that's all you got to do to ascertain whether your kids are alien lizard people. So you're welcome. <laughs> and cut 
and cut on that.